guys, what's up? And welcome to the next episode of the Wonder Real Kermode. I did actually make an error in saying the shadow chemistry. I meant to mention catalyst, but I mixed the two chemistry styles up. This improves his sprint speed, his uh, agility, his passing. He's just a fantastic player and extremely thrilled to have him. And by the way, the player I got as the backup, I thought would be a great idea, Loris Karius. He'll be very good in case Butland ever gets injured, so should have done something like that earlier, but it is perfectly fine there. So we're playing a 4-2-2-2. Happy enough with the lineup. We're getting into the Champions League quarterfinal for Atletico Madrid. So therefore, it is a key occasion as we hope to grab a victory over them. So yeah, let's get into this. Um, and hopefully we can grab a victory. Come on, Newcastle. Alright, so, first game of the episode. We are playing against Atletico Madrid in the Champions League quarterfinals. It's obviously a really big match as we are hoping to continue on and make our progression in the series. So, I haven't played uh, this series in a day or two, um, but yeah, enjoying it very much. I'm thinking I might want to do a summary episode of sorts, as I want to see maybe if our team is good enough to win the treble after we have fully assembled it. But yeah, either way, we're going to take a look at the uh, Athletic Major team. We sold Griezmann off them, so they're running with a 4-2-2-2, exact same as us, but surprisingly they've bought Valère Germain from Monaco, and our lineup uh, we got Jesus and Pele up top, Neymar and Son in the attacking midfield spots, and we got Nangal and Pogba there, and the usual defensive back line. Nelson Semedo is going to get another chance, even though he had a quite poor performance, so let's get into it. Let's go. Oh, gets bullied off by him. Oh, okay, nope, I made a mistake there. Oh my, three minutes in, we've conceded already. What a horror show in the defense, and... Disaster. Absolute disaster. I don't know what to say. She didn't get the ball, and I was just not really up to it for the first few seconds. Samito, uh, Pogba. Finish in! It's Pele! And there we go! It is the clutch finish we need from the Brazilian legend! Beautiful as you can get. Intricate passing play, breaking down the Atletico defense, brilliantly, perfectly timed run by Pele, and it's a world-class finish into the corner. That's a great goal, absolutely huge for us there. Good goal, good finish. Let's make the most of it. Oh my! Oh no! Butland! You mong! Unbelievable! We've conceded again! We've conceded again! Unbelievably poor defense. I do not... Sergio Ramos gets... Oh my! No! No! Butland! I might actually sub you off at half time! He's been absolutely poor this half. And okay, we have a corner here. Okay. It's headed in! Goal! It's Jesus! And we've got it from the corner routine, and our two strikers have each got a goal! And it's the recently upgraded Gabriel Jesus who heads it in. It's 2-2 at halftime. Brilliant cross by Son, and a rising header from Gabriel Jesus there. Great header, great goal, absolutely clutch. We desperately needed that goal, and Jesus pops up with it. Come on, let's get into halftime. Let's just get into halftime so we can keep it the way it is. And there we go. It's halftime. No changes are necessary. Been very happy. Um, 
the defense is poor, but uh, it's tolerable. And we don't really have any defensive substitutions unless I want to try to get playing Gareth Bale at a right back, which I'm not going to do. Oh, what a ball. I didn't even expect him to try to... Ref, you're having a laugh. Ref, how is that not a pen? Oh, that's unbelievable. Okay. I'm going to make substitution, I think. Um, Best is going to come on for Neymar. Uh, s yeah, that's going to be it for now. But, uh... Come on, come on, man. We really. Oh my, what a miss! What an incredible game against Atletico Madrid. That was so incredibly even. That was probably one of the most thrilling games I've played this whole entire series. Alright, so we're gonna spin the wheel of the draw and. Sign a free agent lower than the 80 rating. So. Okay, um, that'll be done for the next episode, um, this one is really just a blasé sort of one, but it's meh, it's okay, it, uh, it'll work, so, yeah. Yeah, so I'll bring on Pereira, someone who's comfortable at the, uh, general left back position. But yeah, this is the team we're gonna take into the match versus West Ham, so we're back to the Prem, but, uh, still a challenge, uh, still a game you never, um, exactly say is gonna be a guaranteed victory, but let's get into it. Hopefully it's a little easier than the match against uh, Athleti, but at the same time, that was such a fun game where it's not the end of the world to me. So yeah, let's continue with our good luck jerseys and uh, get into this match. So, second match of the episode, we are playing against Everton. And at the moment, we are on really, really good form. We want to continue um, playing smart as we have been in the last few games. Obviously, the draw against Atletico Madrid is not exactly what I planned. You'd obviously love to win every single game. However, in reality, um, the change to Legendary was purposely brought forward to provide more of a challenge, and it really has, actually. It's definitely provided much more of a thrill to the series. Player ratings. There there we go. Okay. All right, so West Ham lineup up in a 5-2-3. Uh, I hate playing against that lineup for freaking sakes. Uh, Kiate in the back could expose his slowness in the defense, but... They got Cresswell Reed, I can't say that guy's name, Kuyate, Fernandez in the back, Obiang and Nordvite in the midfield, and there's Lanzini, Carroll, and Ayu. And you already know our lineup, but uh, there was one or two changes, so uh, let's get into the match. Okay, that's that's a wasteful ball. Now Semedo... Oh, oh! Son Hung Min! What a strike! Beautiful! From the Korean! A beautiful ball, shows the raw pace, and just a smack from an audacious angle. It is Son Hung Min with a brilliant strike. Fantastical indeed. That is just perfect. That is absolutely perfect from Son Hung Min. Oh, what an audacious strike, but what a brilliant one. Oh, great! Great defense! Great defense! Absolutely shocking! I Where is Paul Pogba when you need him? Oh, that's just shocking. That is just so shocking. Oh, we've conceded right before halftime. Great! Okay, it's halftime. Uh, we're gonna make a change. So I'm gonna bring off um, someone who's been extremely poor in the game. Uh, Adrian Rabiot is gonna come on for Pogba. Uh, Neymar for best, who's been weak at best. If you oh man, we're playing friggin' West Ham. Okay, we've created some panic. Neymar, go, 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 oh, it's Neymar, who scores the goal, 84 minutes in, it's a great finish, and Neymar rescues us at the depth, beautiful turn there, brilliant control, a great pass into him,
but a very, very solid individual goal. And yeah, the Thunder backed away a little bit, and finally, Neymar buried his chance. Huge goal, it's 2-1. We are not going to let this lead get out of our grasp. Get in there. Oh, can't get the chance away. Can we finish it? There we go, okay. A narrow, unconvincing, and quite lethargic 2-1 victory over West Ham. In the wheel now, what are we going to be able to do? We're going to upgrade player to the next special card. So, I'm probably um, going to take Paul Pogba and upgrade him to his 91 in form. So, I'll probably make him around a 95 in game, but he should be very overpowered and... Uh, yeah, I really can't wait to use them. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And yeah, I shall see you guys later. Peace!